Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sam from MumbleTechVideos.com. Today on Android Appaholics, we're going to show you this app. It's called iFont. And with this application, you can change the system fonts on just about any Android device. All right, so I'm going to launch this application here. And you're brought to this main screen here with several different languages. And then it shows how many fonts are available for each one. If you swipe from the left to the right, you pull out the settings menu. And in here you can reboot the phone, you can change the font size, you can go into the settings. You can get some feedback, check for updates, and then there's some other choices here. Change log, things like that. Now across the top you have some settings, you have online, those are the fonts that are showing up here. You have local, which are fonts that you have saved on your phone. You have installed, it shows all the fonts that are already installed on your phone. And then you have a custom section where you can customize fonts. But most people are going to go to the online here and check out the language that they want. I'm going to go for English and there are a ton of different fonts here that you can check out and they're all alphabetical has a little preview there I've already looked at most of them let's go down towards the bottom where some I haven't looked at yet and you see some of the previews go ahead and pre-render what that's supposed to look like some of them do not so if you just tap on one it pops up and it loads then it shows what the font is supposed to look like. If you go to the right, you get a little demonstration, quick brown fox, showing what every letter will look like. Down at the bottom, you can choose to install or you can return to the list here. So let's pick one to install. Very simple. Let's see what this one looks like. So that looks cool, Romance Fatal Serif. So we'll install that. I want to download, and it's going to download the font, and it's very, very quick. I'm over Wi-Fi. Then you can choose to set it, and that's what we want to do. You want to set it. Now I should mention that this requires root to change these fonts, and I've already accepted uh, root access here, so we don't need to do that again set font to romance fatal serif and I click OK and it sets it and then it relaunches the application and if we go into our pull down you'll see that everything has changed so all of our fonts now are that custom now I've come into the font style here in my display settings because I wanted to show you that we are on the default font for this ROM that I'm using, but we have changed that now. So now you see that the default font is the Romance Fatal Serif, I believe is what it was, that we set. So this will change the default font on your device. So keep that in mind whenever you go to change the font it's going to overwrite the default uh, font on your device. I keep saying font so many times. But one way to correct that is in the simplified and the traditional, let's go in tra traditional, they have the default fonts. Uh, they have Arial, Roboto is in here. So you could always go back. In fact, I think we'll try Arial. And I'll go ahead and set this. Arial was a big download, so it's taking a minute here to get going. All right. So now I'm on a very familiar font that I'm more comfortable with. So there you go guys. This was iFont. This is a paid application in the Play Store. I'll put a link down below. 
real easy uh, way to change the system fonts on your device and works perfectly. So be sure to check it out. Thanks for watching the video, guys. This is Sam with bubbletakevideos.com. As always, I'll see you next time.